and welcome back to Train Simulator 2019. Today you join me in another race. My name is Lazy Jen. Today we're going to be doing a Thomas the Tank Engine race. In the blue corner we have Thomas, Percy, Toby, Oliver, Dark, James, Henry, and Gordon. Whew. That was us. That was a speed. That was a speed round because there's so many. There's so many engines we're going to be racing today. If any of you have any complaints about how these models look or how they run, don't take this person, okay? But these models are totally rubbish. As usual, we're going to be programming every single one of these engines to do 120% power. And I'm going to be driving the Superclass 47 to see which one of the Thomas and Friends characters is the fastest. But if I had to say which model I think is the best, I mean, the Thomas the Tank Engine, that, it's, it's not bad. I mean, there are like one or two things I have an issue with. But out of all the models, I think Duck is probably the best model out of all of them, in my opinion. But with Henry and James, I mean, they're quite bad because um, they've well, got some texture missing. I mean, look at the texture on James, it's tender. That's pretty bad. If I had to put in any money on which one I think is going to win, um... Do you know what? I actually don't know. I'm pretty sure. I don't, actually, I, I couldn't say. I, I really couldn't say who's going to win this. I mean, this is actually. This is too close to call. Cool. So, well, why don't we just program them and just see what happens, shall we? Okay, so programming's done. And I'll tell you what, this is going to be a really fun race. Actually, I'll tell you what, let's move, um, let's move James back a little bit. Move Henry back a little bit. And let's move. Gordon back a little bit. There we go. Oh, I'm really excited. I've never done a race this exciting in a long time. So as as always, I'm gonna be driving the Superclass 47, and we're gonna let these guys go. So who's ready for the very first proper Thomas and Friends race in history? This is like the recreation of um, the Great Race, really. Okay, let's press this button, and in three, two, one, go for it! Oh, look at this. Oh no, the three tender engines are being left behind. That's new. I thought the tender engine engines would have a chance but look at all the tank engines they're so in sync right now it's been a long time since i've done any racing with tank engines and here we go we've got thomas percy toby oliver and duck all in sync <laughs> and i can see james henry and gordon just far in the distance but they're not really that far behind either really this is one of the closest races i've ever had look at this so we have duck we have oliver we have toby we have percy we have thomas we have james henry gordon but I don't know why those these three are falling behind. I thought they'd be faster, but I guess I'm wrong. I have programmed all of these engines to do 120% power, so like none of these would ever like it can't be a tie. I mean that would be like impossible. Never in my life have I seen a race look so close. Look at this. What is th what is this? How is this race so close? It just looks so weird to see all of them in sync. That's weird. The sounds pretty amazing, actually. Ah, no, the sounds it sounds like trash. But look at this, and I want to say as well, I, the, most of these models are so bad, but it just looks so cool. I mean, it sounds pretty incredible. I mean, James, Henry, and Gordon are still falling behind. I don't know why these guys, those guys, are slow. I mean, I thought they'd be pretty faster since they're tender engines. Apparently, this is their top speed. Apparently it's 59.9, so I guess this is their top speed. We'll say 60. It's not very impressive, is it? Okay, it's been about half an hour, and they've finally entered the corner. Well, the very first corner, and here they go. And so this should start leveling out a bit now, because even though they're all going the same speed, Thomas actually does have the inside line, and Duck has the outer line. So I think Thomas will actually start taking the lead. There we go. That's more like it. That's what we want to see. This is what this is what I was looking for. I wanted to see some action. So we have Thomas coming on the inside, followed by Percy, followed by Toby, followed by Oliver, followed by Duck, and then coming up is James, followed by Henry, and then followed by Gordon. Now this is more like it. Thomas has a great lead, and James is starting to overtake Henry and Gordon. This is what I was looking for in the first place. Some separation now so they're not all in sync i mean we can't have a tie raise i mean that's just impossible but we can now actually have a good look of these engines um one by one so there's thomas good there's percy cool. most of these models do look terrible don't they toby followed by oliver oliver looks too tall i don't know about you guys but oliver does look a bit too tall followed by duck i mean i think duck actually that's actually one of the best models i've seen in thomas sanction character but as i said i'll leave a link in the description below if you guys want, actually want to download these models but there's james missing his texture sorry james but there's henry and Gordon and they look absolutely terrible as well I mean their rods don't even like work properly that's a, that's a big shame that's so trash oh my god I just pulled up next to Thomas <laughs> look at this it's the most glitchiest thing in the universe 
That face doesn't even look like Thomas. I mean, I know that, I mean, credit's due. The face is 3D, and that's actually pretty impressive. Good detail. But it doesn't even look like Thomas, that face. But, as I said, you know, pretty good detail. I mean, it's better than that face. Look at that face. That face is just terrible. Give a little horn. Goodbye to Thomas. And then goodbye to Percy. <laughs> Don't look at me like that. What's the matter with you? And there's Toby. Toby doesn't look too bad, to be honest. Followed by Oliver. Mm, Oliver looks all right. I, I still think he looks too skinny and too tall, but Duck looks pretty impressive. Look at Duck. Duck is good. But it's a bit, it's, a, it's quite laggy though, so you can't really see. But there's James, followed by Henry, followed by Gordon there, falling behind badly. I wasn't expecting them to be slower. It's terrible. So there's Thomas, followed by Percy, followed by Toby, followed by Oliver, followed by Dark, and James has got a bit of a lead now. God, look at that tender, missing texture, that's bad. And we are uh, followed by Henry, followed by Gordon, who Gordon is in stone dead last. And here come our engines. Who's going to be the first engine to stop? It's going to be a close one. I've never seen a race look so close to ever. This is so amazing. So here it comes. Who's going to be coming in first place? Is it Thomas, the number one engine? Well, there we go. I mean, he isn't the number one, so he should come first. Okay, so here we go. Who's going to stop first? Or is it going to be a tie? We don't know. It's close. It's Thomas, Percy, Toby, Oliver, Duck, James, Henry, and Gordon. In that actual order, I think. Brilliant. That was a really close race. Pretty pointless, but close. So who do you think won, my friends? Would it, should it be Thomas, Percy, Toby, Oliver, Dark, James, Henry, or Gordon? Which one do you think won, or do you think it was a tie? Because I think, I mean, without the bends, obviously, if it was just a st straight line, I think it would have all been a tie. Well, not by these three, but I think out of these guys, I think that it would, I think it would have been a tie, maybe. I'm not too, sh not too sure. Not too sure, indeed. But hope you guys did enjoy watching this video. I mean, I... I always ha enjoy creating these amazing epic train races, but if you want to see more then leave your answer in the comment section below And as I said, I'll leave a link in the description as well So you guys can actually download these models, but you know as I said, they're pretty bad. They're pretty terrible But again, thank you all so much for watching my friends. Have a good day, and I'll see you all in another train simulator Race and until then remember it is all about the game, and I'll see you all next time. Take care my friends Farewell, and have a good day. Goodbye